Red Dreaded Entertainment, what is up guys? My name is Akasan. Here we are getting into, uh, I haven't done this in a long ass time. For reals. It's time for a reaction. <laughs> it sounds so weird even saying that. Uh, but, uh, you guys have re been requesting it. It's, uh, available now. And, uh, your boy is back from America. So, uh, we got we gotta get back into the swing of things. Uh, this fucking studio's getting kind of crowded and shit. Yamcha is dead. Um, hey, uh, I, um, actually have a story I can tell you guys at the end of this video if you're interested, so make sure you like and subscribe for that. It's Dragon Ball related in regards to New York, and I actually met, uh, a very famous, uh, person. I'll tell you that at the end of this video, but, um, what I wanted to say is, I think I might have watched uh, trailer th two or three already in New York at New York Comic Con. I was part of the press panel and covering some shit and I actually got a chance to talk to uh, English version Goku a while back um, at a private party. I might have seen this trailer already, I'm not sure, it's a little bit of a daze, but this one was just released on YouTube, so I'll let you know. Let's take a look. Let's go. Wait. I changed the setting. Ooh, dynamic. Alright, here we go. Aw, oh, shit it. Hey! Vegeta! That hair. Yeah! Maybe I have Okay, I haven't seen this. What is this song? Holy shit, Vegeta! <laughs> All right. All right. All right. Okay, a story told through con. Now let's go. Oh, that looks fucking dope. Oh, fuck yes. Well, that was quick. Whoa! <laughs> A Saiyan showdown. All right. Thanks for watching. Shit. You enjoyed this? You're welcome, buddy. Thank you for bringing this to us. Um, well, fuck, dude. All right, what's going on then? Come on, come on, come on. Nah, is there anything more to it? Mute and play. Uh, all right. So it is what it is. That was pretty dope in, in itself. Um, it's not the trailer I saw. I saw one that was more uh, story oriented, and that might that might have already come out to be honest. Um, there was, uh, and I saw it first in Japanese, and then they showed it in dub, and it was a really different experience. Uh, so okay. So now we see that Broly is uh, fighting not for what he, uh, not just to fight, just it's gonna be a story told through fighting. I hope this works well, man. Um, I am debating how I'm gonna go about and watch this because I actually do have the poster. <laughs> Funimation, thank you so much, Funimation. You, uh, you, uh, you hooked your boy up. I, you hooked your boy up and I, I disrespected you. I dishonored, oh, here it is. I used the uh, Ant-Man. <laughs> I used an Ant-Man in the Wasp uh, poster. <laughs> that's, 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 a, that's the only good that movie was. To protect my Dragon Ball uh, Broly uh, poster. It was fucking dope, right? Anyways, um, so, and Avatar, the unsold story of Kyoshi. That's going to be dope. Uh, make sure you guys are checking out the Patreon, by the way, because we have a lot of stuff. We're already on season two of Legend of Korra and uh, My Hero Academia on uh, season three. And now my story. So two weeks ago, I was uh, just taking the subway up 
Alright, I was taking the escalator from the subway here in Shibuya, which is the New York, uh, the Times Square of Tokyo, and I saw this one woman with the fucking uh, surgical mask on, and um, there's only two times you really wear a surgical mask out here, is to protect yourself from allergies or if you don't want to be noticed. And it's not springtime right now, so I was looking at this woman, and I was like, I was like, hey, hey, I know her. I've seen her before, I know this face. She had bright red hair like me. And I'm like, I know this woman. And I'm like, I think that's uh, fucking Son Goku and shit. So we're going up the escalator. I tell the story better in Japanese uh, because of the tones, but I go, I'm going up that, we're going up the escalator, two different escalators, same direction. And she starts looking at me because she starts noticing me like this. And then I'm just like, I'm like, I come up, I'm like, see what I said. I know. And she she looks at me and she's like, oh, yes. Like, <laughs> and I'm like, oh shit, it's her. It's fucking Son Goku, son. And so I try, I don't spaz out. And I'm just, just like, uh, ja, uh, uh, New York, Mita. I'm like, I saw you in New York a few weeks ago, or like a week ago, and she was like, Arigato gozaimasu, like that, and I'm like, I'm like, ah, itsumo, itsumo arigato gozaimasu, itsumo, itsumo, like, thank you for everything, thank you always, as always, saying arigato gozaimasu, and then we just both look back up the escalator and continue along our path. No selfie, because this woman is like, 86 years old, man, and with DC Sun, I have this experience uh, uh, when I go around with DC Sun and people start recognizing him. He's the most popular, maybe the most famous Japanese, uh, most famous foreigner in Japan, definitely the most famous black man in Japan. And um, uh, when people start noticing him, one person takes a selfie, then a whole crowd takes a selfie, and then suddenly he has to dash out and hide in a toilet stall for five minutes until people disappear. I ain't about to do that to an 86 year old woman, so my story is enough of a memory for me. So that was really cool to meet her, and then two weeks prior to that, I met the English voice actor, uh, Sean Schimmel. I met him at a party in New York, so. My life is complete. All that is left now is Vegeta. That would be great. All right. There you go, guys. Hey, if you enjoyed that video, if you enjoyed my story, please hit the subscribe button below. I would appreciate it. I will try to do some regular reactions um, from uh, time in, time out when I get a chance. It's just that my focus is, uh, is elsewhere, providing you other types of entertainment. I hope you're enjoying that as well. Till next time, guys, and uh, we will... Uh, try to give you some more Dragon Ball stuff as well. Till next time, I'll talk to you later. Come